Hey, what's up? Come on in. Hey, so it's Misha from Periphery. Welcome to our bus. We are currently on tour with Nothing More, Woven War, and Thank You Scientist. And uh, I figured I'd give you a little tour of our bus home area. So this is where the driver sits and drives. Our uh, driver, Harlow, is awesome. Really cool guy. This seat is usually empty, but sometimes uh, Alex Marquitis, our uh, sound guy, will come and sit there. And, uh, and other people, whoever wants to sit up there, kind of get a view. But we don't really hang here too much because the rest of this is way cooler. Um, so, this is in a cleaner state than it usually is. Uh, I think way more than last time, but this is the front lounge area right here. Um, so this is usually where half of us will tend to chill since there's 12 of us on this bus. Um, so there are physical limitations there, but uh, we have our TV here. Uh, and we have one of the uh, three PS4s that we brought on tour because we've got to have uh, lots of PS4s to keep everyone entertained. I think right now we're playing Dying Light. We just beat The Evil Within and everyone just kind of crowds around and watches and trade controllers. It's, it's good fun. Uh, well, on the bus I brought Destiny uh, because I'm absolutely addicted to that game and Jake also is playing that so we play that on the back. We use our uh, phone internet to, uh, <laughs> to, to power that since it needs to be played online. Um, and uh, I just got Dragon Age, which I'm going to start playing. I'm definitely going to buy Dying Light now. Um, so those have been the mainstays. We have caught up here. Sometimes I'll bring my controller and play with Nolly. Just like play against bots just for fun. Um, so yeah, this is, we do a lot of gaming and watch a lot of movies up here. And otherwise just chill. Uh, we have a little kitchenette area here and a fridge full of uh, the essentials of living. Red Bull, condiments, cheese. We try not to eat. Uh, too much crap on the road. We try, we try to go out and find some good food. You know, we're all, like, I'm 30, everyone's around the same age. We can't eat like what we did when we were 25, do a dollar menu and whatever. Uh, so this is kind of last resort food here, like after a show. Like if, if, if I don't eat food after a show and everything's closed, there we go, that'll, that'll get me uh, to the next day, I guess, you know? <laughs> so we don't rely on this too much, but we're glad to have it for when we need it. Um, this is the bathroom over here which is different on this bus in that uh, it has a shower and for those of you who don't know there's no pooping on buses this bus is no exception either if you're on tour you know that rule but the cool thing is that you do have a shower so at least you can clean off which is, which is great unfortunately we are in uh, Chicago in a snowstorm right now so everything's frozen and I don't think our shower actually works so uh, this is where the day sheet goes today uh, seem to have this fan painting of a pair there, which is kind of nice. But this tells us everything we need to know right here. Um, what time everything is, what our uh, Wi-Fi is, and sometimes it'll even have the, the length of the drive the next day, just if, we, if it's a really long one, we need to know that. But bus call is important. We've got to be there by 2 a.m. tonight, or else we're in trouble. Uh, everyone's been really good about it, though. So uh, we have no excuse to not know this information. It's all right there. So this area over here, the bunk area. This is my bunk right here. Um, and it's pretty straightforward. 12 people can sleep here relatively comfortably. This bus rides very smooth, so it's relatively easy to sleep at night. This brings us over to the back lounge. The back lounge here, we have like the world's first LCD monitor or TV there. We never use it. It just seemed to be hanging stuff off of it. So I brought my own screen um, <laughs> and my PS4 and so did Jake, he packed his away, but he usually sets up right there, we'll play Destiny together, uh, or just whatever. Uh, yeah, we're big gamers. So, <laughs> we just kind of set up uh, in here if we want to do that. Interestingly enough, these can uh, fold down and make a, a nice big bed, uh, though we don't really need to do that because we have 12 people and 12 bunks. So uh, that pretty much wraps up the tour of the bus. Uh, thank you so much for watching. And if you are watching, remember to check out our new albums, Juggernaut Alpha and Juggernaut Omega. They just dropped on the 27th of January, and you can pick them up physical stores, iTunes, Amazon, all that good fun stuff. Uh, and uh, if you can still catch us on this tour, we're still finishing up some dates on the East Coast and Northeast. So be sure to come out and rock out with us.